If you are looking for a resource for your essential oils, then you need to consider this Essential Oils Pocket Reference 7th Edition. Now this is perfect for beginners and it's still useful for those, you know, like me who have used oils for years. You can easily find information by looking up the knee or by looking up the specific oil. Now you can look up an ailment in this reference book and you'll find a brief explanation about it and then the single oils or the oil blends that can be used for it. Now there is another section where you can look up by the oil or the blend and there's going to be a history about it and what it is used for. Now I know this pocket reference was specifically written for Young Living, but 90% of this book refers to oils in general. So anybody can use this. Keep in mind, this is not a medical directory and doesn't replace a physician's diagnosis. However, it does provide holistic options for your different ailments and the multiple uses for the oils. Let me open this reference book and show you some samples. Okay, so I started at Appendix A. Now there is a legend that tells you what type of oil it is with those little letters here on the left hand side. Now when you turn the page, right, we can go to Cedarwood. It's a single blend oil and it can be used for the nervous system, it can be used for emotional balance, and it can be used for the skin and hair. Now I use Cedarwood every single morning because I put like a drop or two in my moisturizer and I do use it all over my face, my neck, and my decollete. Now you can also go by the ailments. If you have a bladder infection, if you have bloating and swelling, it kind of gives you a little description. And then the single oils or the oil blends that you can do to help with the ailment. I use oils all the time, whether it's for a headache or a sore throat. I really believe that there's a holistic approach to oils. So if you are looking for a great essential oils pocket reference, I highly recommend this one. As you can see, it's a thick reference guide and I use it all the time.